Hi, Hiram here. Really surprised. I thought by now, <clears throat> excuse me, I thought by now you guys would be tired of seeing me doing tests on this stove. But I've gotten a bunch of requests to run it with SBIT, which surprises me too. So I thought I'd give that a try today. Please excuse my throat. I seem to have a sore throat for some reason. What I'm going to do is I have, <clears throat> I'm going to use a full cube of SBIT. That's supposed to last for about 13 minutes. Take that out of the package. That's one of the nice things about ESPIT. They come individually wrapped. Okay, now we all know that the easiest way to start ESPIT is to take your knife or something and scrape off some crumbs onto the top of the cube. That lights a whole lot easier than trying to light the bare cube itself. Okay, so I have a, I should have showed you that. I have a little uh, tin can lid here to keep the bottom of the the ISO clean stove clean. I'll put the cube on top of that. starts right up. Can you see that? Now since this isn't, we don't have a blooming thing here, but I do want to wait until the cube gets going pretty good. A lot of people still like to use these for their stoves and stuff. I like to keep them for my survival gear or my backup gear, but they're pretty nice. They're a little slow on starting up. What I have here is two cups of water sitting at room temperature, which is 57 degrees. The humidity is 61%. Okay, it looks like we got a flame going there. Let me put the two cups on, and we'll see where this goes. Okay, there we have 210, 211, come on, 212 at 1218, okay, let me take this off the fire. Yeah, that's one of the bad things about ESPIT. It stinks <clears throat> when it's burning and it leaves a lot of fumes go. But I like to try to save the uh, ESPIT crumbs. They go good in fire kits. Oh man, that's bad. Uh, they go good in fire kits. Now you can see that really sooted up the inside of the stove and that can. So it is kind of messy. Can you see that? How oh, I got sticky like residue there. That's why I put the can lid there to try to cut back on that a little bit if I could. And let's see what the bottom of the pot looks like. And oh, can you yeah, can you see that? There is some not soot so much, but it's more like residue. 
over where the uh, flame was burning. So that's SBIT, one SBIT cube in an ISO clean stove, which is really meant, the, that's a stove put out by Fat Cat, yeah, sorry, Fumes. It's a stove put out by Flat Cat Gear, the ISO clean stove, meant to be run with isopropyl alcohol. But this was one cube of SBIT. It brought two cups of water starting at 57 degrees to 212 degrees in 12 minutes and 18 seconds. And there's still a little bit of a, what I call crumbs there that I can save and just put in a plastic bag or something for a fire kit. Okay, so I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now. No, you've been a good friend. And that's in the second And I know it's never gonna end.